Brennan J. Today I'm out here with Johan. He's a Livingston Lure Pro. So today we're out here in Miami, Florida doing something I've always wanted to do. This guy catches peacock bass out here and go. he said he's gonna put me on him, man. Absolutely. Apparently this guy knows where the fish are. So we're gonna go out here. Guys, I've wanted to catch a peacock bass since I was like this tall. I've literally wanted to catch a peacock bass since I was like six or seven years old watching them like be caught in the Amazon and they're right down here in Miami, Florida. This is so insane. Oh yeah, you're gonna so have fun, So insane. <laughs> oh man, I'm excited. <laughs> All right, I, I can't even do a long intro because I'm so excited to go fishing, guys. So we're gonna go ahead and get to it. Let's do it, see ya. Seriously, guys, we're about to catch some peacock bass. I am so stoked. All right, guys, so right now we're about to get uh, tied up. We're gonna be fishing for any type of species. We can catch peacock bass out here, regular bass. We can catch tarpon, snook. We've got a whole bunch of options. Right now I'm throwing on the 121 jerkbait by Livingston. Hopefully this will be the ticket. Guys, look at this. Oh, we're definitely in Miami now. If you can't see behind me, there's an old dinosaur called an iguana. What the <laughs> heck is going on? <laughs> Yon over here is like, hey man, look at that iguana. I'm like, oh my God, that's the first time I ever even seen one. I thought they were green. He said the males are orange. Crazy stuff out here in Miami already. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh. gosh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Go, go, make a cast around that area. All right. I got this one. Go. There. I think I lost it. Oh, you loser? Yeah, I lost him. Oh. He went way to that thing. Super smart fish. Go. Oh. Oh, you got one? Yeah. I don't know. I don't, it doesn't look like a big cup. Might be, man. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's a little peacock. Yo, put it back in there. I knew there was one there. Yeah? But I don't know why it didn't hit yours, but you bait. <laughs> that's awesome, man. We broke the ice, man. We got one right here. Beautiful fish. I've never seen a peacock bass until right now. Very cool. Oh, oh there it is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> nice. I don't think it's a big one, but it's a peacock. It's a peacock. There we go. The first peacock ever, man. That is awesome. All right, guys. Well, I just got my first peacock bass ever. It's not a huge one, but we've been grinding out here all day. She hit the topwater plug, got it all on camera. This is a special moment, man. Ever since I was a little kid, I've wanted to catch one of these, man. This is awesome. All right, first peacock bass ever. I'm going to get a release on this guy right here. What a beautiful fish. Wow. There she goes. Got the first peacock, got a dream fish of mine. I'm super stoked. We've been out here working it so, so hard. Finally got one, it's paying off. Let's get some more. All right, right on the edge. Look, 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 it's there, right there. Right there, right in front of us. Look, 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 look. Oh, look, I look, see him. See that? Yeah. Bring that here, make close to Go in front of him. Oh, yep. Yeah. yeah, I got him. You got him? I got him. Yeah, he's got a peacock. Oh man, check that out. Peacock number two on the jerk bait. Nice. All right, man, this is a uh, peacock number two right here. This is amazing. This is amazing. They're starting to bite. These fish are so cool. Super aggressive. This fish fought like it was like a three pound largemouth. Super awesome fish. Let's get a release on this guy. All right, fish number two, headed back to the water. Awesome. All right, guys, we've been fishing all day long. We caught those two with a matter of five minutes in between each other. We saw another male over here, so we're gonna toss to him. He's about four pounds. If we can get him, that's our fish right there. The way they are. Get it deeper? I mean, uh, the, the jitterbait kind of, you know. Okay. Come down. There he is. Oh, that's a big one. That's a, oh, he just came off. He just oh, came no. off. He just came off. Yeah. He was a big boy. I know. That's a male. I told you he would catch him. Oh, will he bite again, you think? Yeah, he will. He probably do. But he got to be on bed. He's there. Oh, my right. goodness. Yeah, that was a nice one. That was a big boy. <laughs> oh, I see him. I see him. Yeah, he's coming. He's coming. Yeah, you got oh, him. I got him. I got him. Don't, 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 don't hurt. Don't hurt. Okay, okay. Don't hurt, okay? All right, man. We got a nice peacock on right now. Oh my God, there's another huge one right under it. Yeah, yeah. Let's get him in here. Oh, there he is! <laughs> we got him! 
Oh my goodness, this was the fish. Four, four and a half pounds. Oh man, would you look at this. <laughs> Guys, this is the fish we were going after all day long. This guy right here, finally got him. I am so stoked, man. All right, let's not get a handful of troubles. This is the one, guys. Look at this guy. How big would you say he is? Four and a half pound. Easy. He's four and a half pound fish right here. Four and a half pound peacock bass out here in Miami. This is awesome. Catching them on the Livingston lures. They've been hitting them now. We, uh, we finally found the pattern. We're throwing the jerk bait to the fish we see on the beds and they can't resist it, man. This chirping bait right here, this one, two, one jerk bait, they're killing it. It's awesome. So got a nice peacock bass, super stoked. We got the big guy, gonna get him released, man. Awesome fish, look at the colors on this. Let him go. That is so awesome. Come on, let's catch another one. All right, guys, let's get some more of these big boys. Oh, I see one. See one? Yeah. Put it around there. You pass it. You have to pass it and bring it to him. And he will hit. Yeah, there, there he is. <laughs> oh, man. Look at this guy. Woo -hoo -hoo. Man, we are on him now. Whoa, this one's bigger. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's <laughs> Oh my goodness, man. That's big. Look at this guy. This is uh, fish number three or four? I can't remember now. They're four. getting bigger, they're getting bigger. So this is awesome. All right, they're getting bigger, guys. Look at this guy, he's, he's huge. All right, releasing him. There he goes, look at how gorgeous this is. Absolutely unreal, guys. Absolutely unreal. Three casts later, got another big peacock bass. We're killing it, man. We're killing it. This guy is awesome. He's putting me on the fish, dude. This is incredible. You got one? Hey, get him in, get him in. Oh, that's a big one, isn't it? I got it with a pro reefer. Oh, nice. There she is, there she is. Woo! <laughs> that's a nice one, man. Right here. Nice, man. Caught her on that uh, Pro Reaper. Pro Reaper, Livingston. Nice, man. Look at this baby. Gorgeous, man. These fish are so gorgeous. That's <laughs> awesome, brother. You go, baby. There she goes. I wish you could see this in the water. This fish is just pounding the bait, but she doesn't have her mouth open. She's just hitting it, trying to knock it off the bed. And uh, we just keep throwing in there. Pretty much every other time, she's hitting it. Mm -hmm. There she is. There she is. That's a nice, That's a nice fish right there. Oh man. Oh, she's running with you. Oh, she came off. That was a smart fish. That was a good one though. That looked like the best one of the day so far. Yep. Nice. So you guys saw exactly what happened. I mean, he said it was gonna happen. You toss in there, make the fish a little bit mad. She keeps bumping it. Eventually she'll hit it with her mouth open to finally get rid of it. And that's when you hook you a peacock bass in Miami, Florida, man. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> man. Oh, she absolutely annihilated it, man. Wow. Oh, man. Look at this. Little show. Let's get her in here. Where you at, girl? Oh, she's probably hooking out. Barely, barely hooked. Jump. <laughs> man, got another peacock, man. Beautiful fish. Let's let her go. There she goes. Ugh, he it. All right, guys. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a fish right on this bed. Oh, there she went. She got it. She got it. Oh! <laughs> All right. Let's see you catch this fish. She's right there. She's wanting it. She didn't want to eat it. She just oh, I went over the... Oh, that, that might have been good. <laughs> you hit it with the towel. You saw that? Yep. She would hit it. Oh, there's another one. There's another. Oh, that's the ticket. She's got it. She's got it. Oh, man, this is awesome. <laughs> so, you guys just watch that fish eat that bait, man. Where's she at? There she is. Man, look at these fish. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous, man. Gonna get a nice little flip in the boat. There she is. 
So we saw that fish just sitting on this bed, pitched in a couple times, got her a little aggravated, and she ate it. That was incredible. He caught it. He was like, man, you just throw it in there a couple times, they get a little rowdy, she'll nail it. So she did. That was pretty awesome. It's a good looking fish right there, man. Good looking fish. Awesome. Okay, here we go. There Ooh. she goes. <laughs> We're on them now, brother. All right, guys, so a little bit of backstory about how these canals ended up here, right? So these actually aren't natural. These are all man-made. These were actually made to drain some of the Everglade water. So when the water got really high during rainy season, they had to drain that water somehow. That's why they created these canals. Also, these edges here, they drop straight off about 14 foot down. They have coral edges. They're hard. They're not like soft dirt. It's straight down. It's hard coral. It's pretty cool stuff. So there's a ton of peacock bass just on the edges of these walls some of them are starting to spawn so you can actually find them sitting on a bed and just keep throwing that bait to them kind of like we've been doing and uh catching some fish it's pretty cool out here man i'm definitely coming back to miami the trip's not even over and i've already decided man i've got to come back here again all right guys well it is coming to the end of the day i'm gonna let yon here tell you a little bit about the lures we were using and some of the techniques all right guys pretty simple we were using today the walking balls Actually, you know, the Livingston lure with the ABS sound. Pro Reaper, again, the ABS sound on it. And the Gerbay, the 121. EBS sounds again. If you guys are interested in checking out any of the lures we used today, you can go check out livingstonlures.com. I'll make sure I'll leave the link below. All right, guys, so we just got done fishing today, man. It was a really, really good day. Caught my first peacock bass. That was a childhood dream of mine, so that was a really big deal for me. I really appreciate you taking me out, man. No problem, man. Big shout out to Livingston Lures for hooking us up, man. He's a Livingston pro. He's an awesome fisherman. They told me, they were like, hey, we got this guy in Miami. He catches peacock bass. He, he's a great fisherman. He catches all these fish. You got to get with him. I did. Super, super happy about it, man. All right, guys. So if you want to check out Jan's website, I'll leave all that information in the link below. Make sure you check him out. If you're ever in Miami or think about going to Miami, you got to hook up with him, man. He's going to put you on some big peacock bass. The bite is on. You guys need to head on down here. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave it a big old thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Shout out to Livingston Lures again for hooking this all up. Big shout out to my man, Jan, right here for putting me on my first peacock bass. Awesome opportunity. Thanks again, guys. Peace. Ah! All right, all right. Slow down, slow down, buddy. Oh my God.